everybody! I'm so excited for this plan with me because it is rainbow theme! Let's get into it. Look at all my pre-plan rainbow. So I'm just going to move these posters up and I'm going to start with these rainbow strips which I made on my computer. Very fine. And I'm just going to trim that one so it fits in with the three Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday boxes. And then I'm just using my repositionable glue mouse to stick it down. There we go. Isn't that pretty? Such a gorgeous thing. The thing with the repositionable glue mouse is that if you do feel that you've put a sticker down wonky or anything like that, you can just lift it back up and then use it and then stick it down again and it's fine. I actually had to re-stick this one, but I didn't I'm not showing that to you, but looks fine doesn't it and then I used a silver washi tape down at the side of the glitter I wasn't sure what to do in terms of color but I thought silver would go good because it's like you know the silver lining of a cloud which you see with rainbows anyway so there's that and then I've got these quote sticker things which I'm just putting in the thankful thought box this one says you can't have a rainbow without a little rain and then the bottom one says there are so many beautiful reasons to be happy and it's in the rainbow colours so I thought it worked out and then I'm just re-sticking the all washi tape and then I'm putting down the backgrounds in the colour order so I've gone for pink, purple, blue, green, yellow, orange and red and I said that backwards because that's the thing that I'm putting it down I don't know why I decided to put them down that order but whatever and then I've got boxes of like glitter in that color so that I use them for the header strips so like the to-do strips and then like the today strips and stuff like that just like I'm showing you now so I just trimmed off the tops for all of them and I decided to do a different style of planning this week and put all of my to-dos and the quotes and the little pictures and like lists at the top and then the second two boxes for today's sections so I thought I'd just change up and see how I feel because this is the way that um, I know Elle and Andrea from Scorpion Prince Co plans and I wasn't sure if I liked it because I thought it was too uniform and then I didn't really have a lot of to do's so I don't know I tried it out and then this what I'm doing now is my vitamin flags which I also made these and they're on like some cute little watercolory rainbow background and then I just did a little open heart with a vitamin bottle and it says vitamins and then I made these TV strips as well also on a different watercolor rainbow background and I just um, applied the little TV on the side and then they fit perfectly in the boxes now I'm just going in with some quotes. This one is from Wicked and I love Wicked. It says, I think I'll try Defying Gravity and you can't pull me down. So I added some background. This one is the green one and I actually also have some half boxes which I made out of the same glitter print and then I just put like a little white transparency box over the top so it's got a little faded area to write in. This orange one is so cool, I just love that picture, I think it's so pretty. And orange stripes, I don't know why I went from green to orange, I guess because those are the two days that were like the easiest ones to do, um, so that's why I did those in that order. And there's the middle today strip there, and then yellow for Wednesday, which is good because Wednesday is hump day, and so when I do my half rainbow spread, picture for half week midweek I mean it's gonna look so weird because it's red orange and yellow and it's like where's the rest of the rainbow so for Monday I I usually do a checklist to do for like the first half of the week and then the Wednesday one is usually my editing day and then so with this Monday one I didn't actually print out enough backgrounds because I forgot that I needed background the to-do list so I used two glitter half boxes instead 
and then here you go you can see me filling the rest of the headers and that blue one I actually cut it the wrong way so it's a little bit too long so I just trimmed it there but I cut that bit to out how funny and then this blue quote sticker that I just put down it's from um, not the, not Wicked, The Wizard of Oz, and it says, if happy little bluebirds fly beyond the rainbow, why, why can't I? Which is in the song Somewhere Over the Rainbow, and I thought it was like, rainbow, and it's blue, and it like goes with the Wicked theme as well, and then, yeah, here's me just sticking that bit of box back where it was. Um, and this dandelion is very cute too, it says make a wish, because like you know when you have dandelion cotton you like make a wish, I thought that was cute, it reminds me of my childhood, I liked the pink aspect. Um, so with the purple I did a more lilac theme so it was easier to write things down, because when you've got dark purple you can't really write a lot of things on it, yeah. So the pink one, I love the damask look and the little bit. I just think they're so cute. And then I use this sort of flower, floral pattern. Now I'm going into my functional stickers and I'm getting my little briefcase meeting ones for work things that are going on. I'm using this Obsessed with Cute Timed Plan sticker because it was pink and it matched the little pink day of Sunday and then I'm using my Lily Daniels Designs workout stickers to mark my dance group and these XOXO Shao ones for Zumba gym bags and these upload record edit ones are also by XOXO Shao. I love them, they're so cute. I've just ordered more so I'm so excited to get them because I'm, I'm running out, can you see? So yeah and then I put the record down one and then you can see me lift it and rip it up again. These watercolour coffee cups are from the Panna Junkie, it's so cute. And then my L Heart Designs Weekend Banner which is pink and purple and it perfectly matches the weekend. The glasses and um, the nail polish here you can see and the little bow that I'm going to put up next is from Lily Daniels Designs. It's so cute love these stickers and then these ones are from the planner junkie as well they go with like the unicorn pegacorn my little pony kind of <laughs> stickers this scalloped box is from ellie beth designs and in fact all the stickers that i'm using now stickers i'm using now are ellie beth designs or apart from these checklists they're from caress press from my watermelon sheet i believe and they seemed perfect checklist to match. They had like a yellowy one, a pinky one and then a dark pink one so I used them for the red. Here you can see me moving my functional stickers from Saturday to Sunday and actually I've, I moved them again after that but you can't see that so there we go. I've got a birthday on Sunday and then some more rainbows because I needed to have something in the top and rainbows are cute and it matches the spread and then I have this big rainbow from Hema from a sticker set so I thought I'd add that and then I forgot I actually have a new TV show that's coming back the Mindy Project and then I pull out my Stabilo pens so I can start writing so here I'm just writing my TV show Mindy Project as I said on Tuesday and then DCC and then I'm writing Contact I need to be new contacts and I've got my dance group on Thursday and then also my godmum arrives and um, my auntie Penny so she's coming so I thought I'd note that down so the little bow is to remind me to buy a new train ticket because I have to buy a monthly ticket so that's why I need to remember when it runs out and then I've got another work thing on Friday so I forgot to add the little briefcase thing and then for recycling day I added this sticker from the woodland set from Ellie Beth Designs actually because it was blue and I didn't use it and I just needed something that I could write recycling day on and then I've got my spa day on Saturday so I used a lilac heart from XOXO Shell. so cute and then here I'm just writing in the with me and then I drew a little heart around the whip and I think it's so cute to have it like that and then I needed to do the Tuesday day, so I 
added some more stickers and you can't actually see what I'm writing with the yellow pen so I did actually go over it with white pen and it's still a little bit not so legible but it's legible to me and white was a little bit easier than to do it in black because I was thinking of just doing the whole spread in black but it looks really good with the other colours so I was just so annoyed that the yellow didn't turn out so well and neither did the red actually but I didn't really plan anything with the red so you can't see anything um, and then same with this Grande Tuesday in the orange I just didn't think when I created the stickers so I'm just using my white gel pen to write the to do, draw the little heart and then that one says edit obviously um, more little hearts and then I also use it to write today on the second strips of all of them so there you go today 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 it just sort of saves money on stickers if you make your own little strips and they really tie in with the theme if you don't buy them because you know that you're going to be using exactly what you've got and yeah so that's the end of the plan with me, not so much planning for the beginning of the week, more so towards the end. Thumbs up if you enjoyed and please subscribe if you haven't already. Bye, happy planning!